Flemeth once told me that temptation lies in the forbidden. Is that Bark Spun? <laughs> boy. Do not follow me, I said. Yet you search even so. Some doors should never be reopened. My baby. This is where I was supposed to kill Flemeth, and that didn't happen. Who are you? Not another step. What are you doing here? How dare you put a knife Call to off my hound. puppy dog. Why are we like kind of twins though? I didn't kill Flemeth. I tried. <laughs> she she ran away. Mysteriously. In the night. Fine, I'll start then. I am Ariane, of the Dalish people. My keeper sent me to find Asha Belinar, the woman of many years. Um, Flemeth? So you know of her. What business do you have with her? We thought she could help us find her daughter, Morrigan. The young witch has caused trouble for my clan. Has she earned your ire as well? Not exactly. She's my friend. She's a friend and I'm concerned for her. A friend? Of all the words associated with the Witch of the Wilds, those are the last I expected. Perhaps you can reason with her then. What is she doing? Morrigan stole an ancient book my clan has guarded since the days of Arlathan. We were the only ones with such a piece of our history. Everything we once had, all legacy of our ancient magics were stripped from us. First by the Tevinter Magisters, then by the Wretched Circle. And Morrigan took what little was left. But what if I want to let her keep it? My keeper, Solon, says it was a treatise on something the ancients called Alluvian. The word is as old as the book itself, and its meaning has been lost, save perhaps to Morrigan. Um, so what now? Help me. We both want Morrigan, and we can aid each other. The Book of Alluvian was reclaimed from my clan by an elven mage who stole it from the Circle of Magi before defecting. He said other similar treasures remain in the library, but they would never allow a Dalish to view them. Perhaps you will meet a different reception. They have to let me in. I'm a Grey Warden. Masilinus, <laughs> I look forward to working with you. Welcome to Ferelden's Circle of Magi. Please, keep your hound under control. Some of the apprentices are easily startled. And I see you have a Dalish elf with you. Is that a problem? The Circle is glad Oops. to have you as a guest. As you can see, things are much changed from when you were last here. Um, I need to go to the library. If you're looking for a book, you can start in the index section. As the Warden Commander, you and your guests are free to explore the first floor of the tower without an escort. Good day to you. Hi. I've heard the stories about the hero of Ferelden. <laughs> Apparently, she once took on a lady pirate and three greased nugs. Between the sheets. <laughs> no. I'll tell you about it later. <laughs> that did not happen. <gasps> How dare they? You want to know something? At least I get to see the world and you're trapped in this tower. Sucks to suck and I have a pirate girlfriend. Bye. <laughs> oh, please. <gasps> Sandal. What are you doing here? A junk mate. Yes. Where's Bodan? Bodan is trading in Redcliffe. If you're interested in his goods, I believe Sandal has some of them to offer you. You don't need to translate for me. I speak Sandal very fluently. Thanks. Is that a purebred Mabari? I wish I had one. They should allow pets in the tower. Don't you remember the Dragonling disaster? Mm -hmm. There's bits of Ivan still burnt onto the ceiling on the third floor. I'm talking about common pets. Dogs, cats, rats, owls, that sort of thing. Owls? What sort of mage has an owl as a pet? That's funny. Wizards. Oh, who let a dog in here? And what are you doing? Be careful! Who are you? Be careful with what? You're bending the book too much. It'll, it'll crack the spine and cause the pages to fall out. Just thinking about it is making me dizzy. His lashes, though. Are you familiar with this book? I've used it. 
but I don't know it by heart. Hmm. Browsing the chapter on the Illuvians. No one's actually found one, you know. You know what Illuvian is? It's old Elvish for seeing glass. Mira. Why is he so nosy? How do you know about that? Cross-referencing, educated guesses, process of elimination. Finally found the answer in a Tavinta scroll. The Luvian isn't just any mirror. It's a special kind. When the Imperium sacked Arlathan, they took these mirrors and tried to unlock their power. But all they could use them for was communication over long distances. Why would Morgan be interested in that? Ah, you have a friend with a special interest. Maybe she needs to talk to someone. <laughs> eh, eh. Hmm. <laughs> My people crossed paths with another Dalish clan not too long ago. Two of their young hunters encountered a strange mirror in some ruins. One disappeared, the other became deathly ill. They never found the one, and the other died. They left Ferelden and traveled north to forget their sorrows. It's Mariel and Temlin. Who's that? Mariel is the Dalish Warden origin. Oh, okay. And Tamlin was their best friend. Oh. What about the mirror? Shattered. Destroyed. <gasps> Why? It was corrupted by the Darkspawn. Beyond hope of recovery. They did it to protect others. Even broken, it could be used to find the others. No, don't get ahead of yourself, Finn. You have to be sure. Finn. What? What do you know? This is so exciting. We have to get to the repository. Hadley has the key. Hadley! Just the man I was looking for. Not looking very hard, were you? I'm always here. <laughs> Good one. So I, um, I need to go into the repository. No. No? <coughs> Why not? I'm not some drooling apprentice. It's because of me, isn't it? No. The Sentinels have been behaving erratically, so the repository is locked for everyone's safety. Oh, well then. Uh, sorry for bothering you. What happened to them? Unfortunately, we are still not sure yet. The repository isn't crucial to the daily functioning of the Circle, so we've left it until we can spare more men. I'll help with this. Oh, very well. I saved it's you. It's your next. But before you go, what's so important down there? The statue. None of your business. It knows things about Tavinta, and I need to speak to it. All right. Be careful, and keep the mess to a minimum. You know that talking to inanimate objects is a sign of insanity. <laughs> Not when it talks back. You think the statue talks to you? It's complicated. It wasn't always a statue. You'll see. Okay, statue, hello. The prison is breached. I see the encroaching darkness. Wow. It does talk. Uh, it does hello? talk. Hello? The... The shadow will consume all. It seems afraid. Something is causing it distress. The tears in the veil, most likely. The statue's useless until we mend the veil. I am the spirit of Eleni Zenovia, once consort and... Advisor to Archon Valerius, blah blah, fall of the house. Yes, yes, we've been through that. Finn, <laughs> greetings. She does know you. You two have a close relationship? We've conversed before. On the <gasps> Ah! Out of it requires passing all the grandiose mumbo jumbo. We know where a broken Illuvian lies. Can it still be used to find the others? Scry, the broken glass, dagger sharp, will be your key. Scry? The lights of Arlathan will illuminate the Scryer's path. The Archons possessed them, but they were misused, befouled, and lost, like so much the Imperium touched. Some were saved, carried by fugitives from the Elven city. Their sorrow awoke the stone, and her children sheltered them. They found a sanctuary in the deep halls of Kad Halash, now known as Kadash. There the lights of Arlathan lie, shielded from unworthy eyes. Is that not? Oh no, that's in the deep roads. 
The Kadash Taig? Impossible. It's not that old. So you know of it. Convenient. Goodbye, Finn. We will not speak again. Why not? What? What's that supposed to mean? Obtain a shard of broken alluvian. The scrying ritual requires a shard of the broken mirror that a Dalish clan once encountered. Find the lights of Arlathan. The scrying ritual requires relics the Tevinter statue called the lights of Arlathan, which are hidden away in Kadash Taig. Does that mean he's gonna die? Why do you think it said we wouldn't talk again? I... Oh, I'm not going to die, am I? Hello? You might, buddy, you might. <laughs> Now, mage, tell us what's going on. The Illuvians are linked, all of them. If you have one, you can find the others, if they still exist. But the one you know of is broken and corrupted, so we need something else to amplify the magic. The lights of Arlathan. Yes. How will this help us find Morrigan? Morrigan is interested in the Illuvians. We find them, we find her. Let me come with you. I can help, please. I thought the mirrors were all destroyed. Okay. I can't pass up this chance at actually finding one. Your knowledge would be helpful. I had permission to leave the tower to continue my research some time ago, but I never had the opportunity till now. I guess there's always a first time, huh? Ready to go when you are. I'm not sure I like the deep roads. A fewer darkspawn than expected, but it feels like we're being watched. Wait, why did we stop? Is this Kadash Taig? Isn't this where, um... Shale! This is where Shale's from. I was gonna say stone. <laughs> um, yes, I've been here before. Right, so... I've, uh, been going through my old notes. Um... And? And I came across this footnote. Apparently, the elves would magically conceal relics of great significance, thus shielding them from unworthy eyes. And given what the Tevinters did, I'd say they count as unworthy. You don't say. Are we unworthy? I hate to say it, but yes. We wouldn't be able to see the lights of our Lathan if they were right under our noses. Mm -hmm. If the elves concealed the relics with magic, only the blood of their kin will reveal them. Ariane, we need your blood. Excuse me? Just a few drops, that's it. Is this blood magic? Um, blood doesn't power the spell, it's just a component. It's certainly a grey area, so let's just keep this between the three of us, shall we? Interesting. Four of us. You share the same blood as the Arlathan elves, so you're the only one this enchantment might recognize. Fine. Just because hearing that gets me all tingly. A few <laughs> drops. I'll... Be gentle. Are they gonna be in love? My spell will reveal vortices of magic. Standing in them should allow us to see the energy being drawn to the relics, which will lead us to them. Once we reach the influence of the lights of Arlathan, Ariane's blood will unveil them. But we have to be close. In here? I think something's here. Is that? Light of Arlathan. I didn't know it was going to be a... Oh, guardians! That's what that word on the scroll My word! The lights of Arlathan are old lanterns. I didn't realize the statue was capable of being literal. So you've never been outdoors? Till now? I have been. I just don't care much for it. We had to do <laughs> stretching exercises. I got sweaty. There was dirt during my apprenticeship. They thought getting fresh air and exercise at least once a week would do us good. Fresh air and sunlight is good for you. You know what feels fresh air in the summer? Mosquitoes. Hungry for Shh. sweet, untested mage flesh. Well, when you put it that way... Luckily, it didn't last long. One day, an apprentice made a break for it. Jumped off the dock and started swimming for the shore. The Templars couldn't jump in after him. Not with the armor on. Finally found him a week later. We stopped having to go out after that. <laughs> that mage, Anders, never stopped trying to escape, <gasps> though. Haven't heard from him since his last attempt. Anders, you sneaky mage. You got outside time taken away from everyone. Hear me we have roar! four lights of our Lathan. I hope that's enough. We still need the shard of the Illuvian, though. Let's head to the elven ruins when you're ready. These are the ruins. The broken Illuvian should be around here. 
Oh, I'm so excited. If you hate the outside so much, why come with us? Couldn't pass up a chance to learn more about the ancient elves and the mirrors. Besides, the company is good. Thanks. Oh. I meant the dog. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go in. Maluvian. Shard. I can't believe this is one of the Illuvians. It's magnificent. And broken. Mostly broken. With the shard and the lights of our Lathan, we should be able to scry for an unbroken mirror. This looks like a suitable place to do the ritual. We can start whenever you're ready. Okay. Scrying spot. Let's go. Get ready! Oh. For what? Oh. I really loved... Oh, oh hold on. I'll finish with Am I them. bleeding? Oh, look, a rip in my robe. Oh, no. What happened to Ariane? Give us your blood. Who cares if it hurts? <laughs> it's my blood. That's different. Um, so did the ritual work? I've pinpointed another Illuvian. It's in the Dragonbone Wastes. The Tevintas probably moved it there to see if the ancient Dragonbones could enhance the Illuvian's power. What do we do when we're there? We examine the mirror. It might give clues to what Morrigan's doing. If she's looking for the Illuvians as well, she might even be there. Shall we? Sure. Through the looking glass, like Alice in Wonderland. We're here. Keep your eyes open for dragons. And mirrors. Thanks, Finn. Landmark skull. Your hand seems particularly interested in this landmark. Is he gonna pee on it again? Well, he is. I guess he has to go somewhere. Dominance is now active. Mark Spawn, you can't just be peeing on everything. Never met a dragon worshipper before. <laughs> Not much for small talk, are they? Why mm -hmm. would anyone worship a dragon? Dragons are big, powerful, and they breathe fire. Some people are easily impressed. <laughs> I am going to have to fight a dragon. I knew it. What is that? Uh... Of our tarot? It can't be. They're only legends. It is said is that? rock and tree, wind and rain, given form and breath by the elven gods to protect their people. I just want to be friends. Please. To protect their people? Then why does it look like it's going to eat you? I want to read about that. What is this? The Vartarel. According to Ariane, the elven gods created the Vartarals to guard the elves and their most treasured artifacts. They are so rare that even the Dalish believe they are only legends. The one you encountered was especially vicious, attacking even Ariane. One of the people it was created to protect. Why exactly is anyone's guess? Because it's a dark spawn one. I don't know. <gasps> Morrigan! Illuvian. And it's glowing. We should. I'm gonna let her have whatever she wants. Hey, Bessie. I miss you. I think she's expecting you. Ask her about our book. <laughs> Oh, don't be mad. I wasn't supposed to look for you. No further, please. One more step and I leave. For good this time. Oh, hello to you too, Morrigan. I assume you know what this is. I have gone to great lengths to find and activate this portal. Give me reason and I use it. And you will not be able to follow. The Olivians are porters, portals to where? To another place. Beyond this world and beyond the Fade. But this portal can only be used once more. Achieving even this much was difficult. I remained to see if it was truly you. I had to know. Aww. Tell me, why did you come? We were friends once more again. So you chase me all this way to offer help? I will never understand you, and you will never understand me. We helped each other, even so. 
Yes. I suppose we did. I would not even know where to begin explaining. What is your plan? I want to know. My plan is to leave and prepare the child for what is to come. Such preparation requires time and power. I must have both if I am to be successful. More than this, I dare not say, even to you. If you romance, you can both walk through the Alluvian after a smooch. Oh, that's very cute. Where's the child? He is safe and beyond your reach. All you need to know is that the child is an innocent. He knows nothing of the destiny that lies before him. I don't think that this is true, but I guess you used us to get what you wanted. I fought with you. I put yeah, my life on I the agree. line to aid your quest. Be mad at me and then because... the battle came too soon. I had no choice but to go to you. And I did not want to see you die. Aww. And here you stand, alive. So do not speak to me of betrayal. I agree. No more questions. Then allow me to provide you a warning. Tis Flemeth you should beware of, not me. Hunt her if you hunt anyone. Why should I? I thought I knew what Flemeth planned. I thought what she craved was immortality. And yet I was wrong. So very wrong. She is no blood mage. No abomination. She is not even truly human. The ritual was but a means to an end. A herald for what is to come. A herald? What is gonna happen? Change is coming to the world. Many fear change and will fight it with every fiber of their being. But sometimes change is what they need most. Sometimes change is what sets them free. And is that what you want, to be free? What I want is... is unimportant now. Oregon... I cannot tarry longer. The time has come for me to go. You don't have to do this alone, Morgan. I wish it were not so. But I do. There is one last thing I must tell you. If you will allow me. I left you a gift. The Dalish book is there. And something you will find of great interest. Goodbye. My friend. Hmm, that's gonna make me sad. And see you soon.